Hi, I'm Lacey Rainey, the Area Superintendent for the Denton Zone. I am honored to serve the 11 campuses that comprise the heart of Denton. We have so many amazing teachers in our zone, and today I am excited to announce our Teachers of the Year. Katie Watkins, Alexander Elementary. Katie Watkins is completing her 15th year in Denton ISD and her fourth year as a kindergarten through fifth grade instructional coach at Alexander Elementary. Ms. Watkins believes the way a person feels about teaching and learning has a direct impact on their classroom community. As an instructional coach and teacher, Ms. Watkins strives to model being a lifelong learner. In her role as an instructional coach, Ms. Watkins works with teachers to accomplish goals they've set for themselves. She says celebrating even the smallest amount of progress is the ultimate reward since students are the benefactor of that progress. Elaine Downey, Borman Elementary. Elaine Downey has worked in Denton ISD for the past 14 years, all as the librarian at Borman Elementary. Ms. Downey is a proponent of introducing new ideas, technologies and resources to students, teachers, administrators, and other librarians. As an educator, Ms. Downey is passionate about stepping out of her comfort zone and trying new ideas. Her biggest reward is when students and teachers open up to her, explaining how she can help them. But above all else, Ms. Downey wants everyone who steps foot into her library to know that she cares about them. Alice Vasquez, Evers Park Elementary. Alice Vasquez is finishing her 20th year in Denton ISD and her eighth year as a fourth and fifth grade bilingual self-contained language arts and social studies teacher at Evers Park Elementary. For Ms. Vasquez, teaching is her way of being able to contribute to change. Before becoming a teacher, she used to think that one person could not make a difference. All that changed when she began her career as an educator. Ms. Vasquez is committed to being a positive influence on her students while holding them to the highest of standards. She says that by far the most rewarding aspect of her career is seeing former students thriving in the community. Crystal Fincher, Sam Houston Elementary. Crystal Fincher is in her ninth year working in Denton ISD, all at Sam Houston Elementary. Since 2019, Ms. Fincher has served as a fifth grade English language arts teacher. Ms. Fincher's teaching philosophy is rooted in the importance of reading. She makes it her mission to help students find books that are based on the things they love or are interested in. Ms. Fincher views reading as not just a life skill for students, but also as an escape and stress reliever. She has seen firsthand how powerful reading can be for a student, not just in the classroom, but in the years that follow into adulthood. That impact is what motivates her each day to guide students on their educational journeys. Amanda Gibson, Newton Razor Elementary. Amanda Gibson is completing her 18th year in Denton ISD and her eighth year as the art teacher at Newton Razor Elementary. Ms. Gibson's approach to teaching is getting her students to think like artists and creators. She wants her students to leave her classroom as creative thinkers and problem solvers, not someone who can simply copy what someone else has done. More importantly, Ms. Gibson wants her students to apply that same mindset to the real world when they become adults. As she puts it, life is a work of art. It's messy and problems arise along the way. She wants each of her students to be equipped for it. Bianca Lopez, W.S. Ryan Elementary. Bianca Lopez is finishing her first year as a kindergarten through fifth grade functional life skills teacher at W.S. Ryan Elementary. As a child, Ms. Lopez always wanted a teacher who made her feel safe and one who celebrated her successes. Today, Ms. Lopez's class is run on love, high expectations, accountability, and clean slates. Ms. Lopez tailors her lessons to fit the academic and behavioral needs of all her students, and she believes every student deserves to be educated and made to feel equal. Zen Gamboa, Calhoun Middle School. Zen Gamboa is in his fourth year as a sixth grade English language arts teacher at Calhoun Middle School. 
Mr. Gamboa had aspirations of becoming a teacher at a young age. His goal was to never let his students learn without a love for learning. He views his job as more than just teaching students how to read and write, but to also inspire them to love learning. To help with this, Mr. Gamboa began inviting students into his classroom during lunch to write stories about their lives. His efforts have paid off, and now Mr. Gamboa believes he is accomplishing his goal daily by helping his students love to learn. Joe Parker, McMath Middle School. Joe Parker is completing his sixth year as an eighth grade science teacher at McMath Middle School. Mr. Parker's motto, not just in teaching, but also in life is, actions are always more meaningful than words. Mr. Parker believes in building rapport with his students while focusing on their social and emotional health. He builds mutual respect with his students in order to gain their trust along the educational journey Mr. Parker is adamant that teachers are like artists in the fact that they must insert their hearts, souls, and identity into their medium, something he tries to do every day. Brenda Silski, Ann Wendell School for Young Children. Brenda Silski is finishing her 11th year in Denton ISD. For the past nine years, Ms. Silski has served as a Head Start ESL teacher at the Ann Wendell School for Young Children. Growing up, she had two passions, criminal justice and teaching children. After obtaining her degree in criminal justice, she realized she wanted to help children before they ended up in the legal system. Ms. Silski believes teachers occupy many roles, including counselors, behavior therapists, custodians, or even parents. In her mind, education is the foundation for a child's future and it is imperative for children to understand the importance of learning at a young age, which is Ms. Silski's daily mission. Karen Stevens has served as a resource math teacher at Denton High School for the past 11 years. Ms. Stevens took a unique path into the education field and did not become a teacher until she was 45. Before that, she was a stay-at-home mom, computer operator, secretary, and even drove a bus for Denton ISD. All things she said prepared her to become the teacher she is today. Ultimately, she decided to become a teacher due to her love for math and her passion to share that love with her students. Her classroom is operated on patience, reassurance, and encouragement as she celebrates her students' successes in both the classroom and life. Congratulations to our Teachers of the Year. We are so excited to celebrate you guys. Thank you so much for all of the work that you do on a daily basis to support our students and make our schools a better place.